A fourth person is dead after a mysterious infection at Greenville Hospital. Hospital officials have been investigating the cause of the infection. They say there have not been any new cases of infection, but that the fourth of the original 15 surgical patients who contracted the bacterial infection died last week and that the cases reach back as far as last year. The bacteria is an environmental contaminant commonly found in air, water and dust. Hospital officials say after an analysis of all the patients, the only common thread that they can identify is the tap water. The bacteria was tested in tap water inside the hospital and in the water coming into the hospital. But as they initially feared, they have not been able to locate the exact source of the infection. And they say they may never know. You go back to what CDC told us in the beginning, uh, we may never find the reason. They have experience in multiple investigations and outbreaks where they cannot draw a direct causation to an outbreak. This is a typical occurrence in that regard. Short of the association with the tap water, we do not have a definitive causation. The hospital has taken a number of precautions, including removing surgical equipment, sterilizing ice machines, extensive cleaning of operating rooms and other surgical equipment, and installing water filtration systems. Hospital officials say the infection has been taking up to 79 days to show up in patients. They've had no new cases since the bacteria was identified and precautions were taken June 1st. But using that timeline, it will be mid-August before patients can consider themselves safe. The hospital has said they'll wait twice that time to be extra sure, and they have sent letters to 180 patients who may have come in contact with the bacteria so that they know that they are at a possible risk.